What's going on YouTube? Legions here coming at you with a video for Archland. If you guys haven't heard of Archland or you haven't seen my previous videos where I reacted to a couple of the trailers and gameplay for the game, Archland is a brand new strategy RPG coming out this year for global, uh, next year for global and it actually finally released about, as I'm recording this yesterday, um, I think it's like December 5th right now. I don't even know what day it is. It's like December 5th or 6th as I'm recording this. And it looks absolutely incredible. Only problem right now, the, it's only released in Korea. Uh, on the Korean version is out. But I'm going to help you guys out because there is an auto translator. Shout outs to the mods in the official Discord or unofficial Discord. I don't know if it's official or not. But the Discord for Archland, they, uh, they put a auto translator in there. I thought I'd share it with the community and kind of help you guys out to want to play this game because the translator is perfect and it runs on PC. This game is on PC, mobile, uh, on Android and iOS. I wouldn't even recommend running it on emulator, just play the PC version. It's super, super good. And of course, this auto translator is for the PC version and not for your mobile version, unfortunately. But, uh, you know, soon enough, global will be coming. But honestly, with this translator, I might not even play the global version if I'm being honest with you. Um, let me show you guys very quickly. I'm going to try to make this video as short and simple as possible. Uh, it's pretty simple. I'm going to show you guys how to install this very, very easily. You just got to move, download a couple files, move them into a folder, change a text in it. And that's that's literally it. If you're not tech savvy, I got you. I'm going to show you guys step by step on how to do this. And it's not complicated at all. So without further ado, let's get right on with the video. As you can see in the official Discord, uh, one of the moderators named Taz, uh, he's in the official, I don't know if it's official, it says Lawn Game, it might be official, might not, um, but this is the uh, Discord for Archland and a lot of people are using this, so this is the downloader for the game, I'll have the link down below if you want to download the Korean version, uh, the Korean PC version, I'll post the link in the description box down below and in the pinned comments, and I'll also post the one for the auto translator as well. Not much, you know, to show here besides you click on this, it brings you to the page and you're going to uh, auto, it's going to ask you to download the game, Archland setup, you just choose where you want it to go. As soon as you're done with that, you're just going to go back here and now you're going to download the auto translator. You download the auto translator, same thing, it's just going to straight download, you're going to choose where you want to send this to. Just put it on your desktop if that if you don't have like a dedicated downloads file or whatever, um, put it on your desktop, it'll be the easiest way for you to get it. So the steps are, once you're officially done with that, you run the launcher, and once you run the launcher, I can't show you guys because I already had the game installed, but once you run the launcher, it's literally just going to ask you to download the game. You're gonna click the blue button. It's always the button on the right, that's the yes button. You, you click yes, it downloads the game, you choose what folder you want to download the game on, and once you download the game, then you can do these steps to auto-translate. It's very, very simple to download the game. Um, if you have any issues downloading the game, let me know in the comments section down below or join the Discord. We have plenty of people in my Discord that can help you guys out. Uh, like I said, you literally just, you click the download link, you, you open it up, it does the little patch download, it's gonna restart the client, and then you can play the game. Once you install the game, Okay, you're gonna download this auto translator. Hey, okay, once you download the auto translator, this is the file for me. It's gonna be called X Unity Auto Translator Repatcher. Um, you're just gonna unzip this and post it. Like if, like I said, if you put everything in the desktop, it's a lot easier for you to find it. You're gonna unzip this. Once you unzip this, it's gonna turn into this X, X Unity Auto Translator, and it's gonna have the patcher right here. What you're gonna want to do is you're gonna put that in your Archland folder. So if like, if you listen to what I said and you put Archland in your desktop or a dedicated folder where you can find it very easily, you're just gonna go right over to that folder. And in the Archland folder, as you can see here, this is the Archland folder, you're gonna want to go to your client. Uh, and then you're literally just going to move or copy and paste the setup repatcher and set it up in here. You're gonna open that patcher up and it's gonna automatically do what it needs to do. And it's gonna create this Archland patch and run. Now, like it says, you're gonna patch and run it. So you're gonna open up that client and you're going to run it. I already did all of this, so I can't show you guys. I wanted to test to make sure it worked properly and it does. Once you guys do this, you're gonna close the game, okay? You close the game after it does the patch. You can honestly use it right after that, but there's a couple of changes that you're going to want to do uh, that way when they edit and, and fix stuff in the translator, it will already automatically update for you, right? So. This is what the, the file is supposed to look like, right? It's called service. I'm gonna show you exactly where this file is, okay? But this is something that you're gonna to need to change. You're gonna to have to go to modify a folder or, or a text file. Very, very, it's very simple, guys. It's very easy, okay? So before you, you guys are like, oh, I'm not tech savvy, I don't wanna modify. It's, it's literally, you delete something and paste this. That's all you gotta do. 
I'll even leave this in the comments and the description um, with what the previous one was and what you're going to copy and paste into it, okay? Uh, to make it a little bit easier for you guys. But all you're going to be doing, okay, you're going to download this file, correction text. I'm also going to leave that link down below. It's called correction text, correction.txt. I'm going to leave that link down below. Once you download that, okay, you're going to put that folder inside the client folder. You're going to go to client, then you're going to go to auto translator. You're going to go to translation, then you're going to go to English, then you're going to go to text. Once you do that, you're going to put the text folder in here. And as you can see, it's called correction. So it's already right there. And once you have put that file in the correct folder, once you put it in the um, the text folder, now what you're going to do is you're going to open up the auto translator folder and open up config. And you're going to change this little these little things right here. Very, very simple. Okay, you're going to go to client, you're going to go to auto translator, and you're going to go to config. I already translated it. Uh, this is going to say Google Translate V2, right? But uh, once you, you're gonna put the correct thing here, which they already put everything for you. Like I said, I'll leave it linked down below so you guys can just copy and paste. So you're gonna change it from Google Translate. It's, it's gonna say endpoint equals Google Translate V2. You're gonna change it to endpoint equals Apago Translate. That's all you're gonna do. You're gonna go back to this folder. You're gonna translate that. Oops, sorry, I already opened it right here. Um, and as you can see, it says endpoint equals Papago Translate. And then the, the one after that is the same fallback endpoint. Literally, the only thing you have to change is what it says Google Translate V2 to this Papago Translate. That's all you got to do. And then right here where it says general language English from language, it says Japan at first. So you're going to change that from JP to KO for Korean. All you have to do, then when you're done, you literally go to file, you hit save. That's all you got to do. That is it. Once you are done doing those steps, you are done, okay? Then you can literally launch the game and you are all set. Now to prove this, that the auto translate works, I'm gonna do it for you guys right now. Okay, as you can see, I'm loading the game up. This is the PC version. Already right here is in English. Uh, sometimes it does take like half a second or a second for it to translate what's on the screen, but it does translate. It's gonna ask you to log in. I'm already logged in. As you can see, this is all translated. Every single thing is translated. This is originally not like this, okay? I could even launch the regular version for you if you guys really wanted to see, if I if you need me to prove it, but I think it's pretty easy for you guys to realize that as it's translated. Okay, and then we're gonna go to, um, I'm gonna open up a new save for you, a new, new uh, server. Okay, and we're gonna click here, the promised land. The music in this game also is incredible, by the way. See, this one's a little bit weird because it's like a narration. Uh, but you can still kind of tell what it says. Came from heaven. Oops, I, I read that too late. This is the human world. The translations are actually pretty good. This is the cutscenes in the game. These are literally the cutscenes in the game. This is crazy. And this is how the main character gets introduced. Yeah, see, all, all everything is translated. Maybe they add a JP voice acting option in the Korean version eventually, but it's time to wake up. That is the main character. That is you. You are the main character. This is you, the summoner right here. You're literally like a god. That's crazy. Apparently, this sword is something that can turn into like a bow and arrow. As you can see, everything's translated. Every, literally, everything is translated. As you can see, literally everything's translated. We even put on auto. I wouldn't recommend putting on auto because sometimes, like I said, it takes a second to translate. Story in this game is actually incredible, by the way. Uh, I'm probably going to be making a lot more content on it. I am loving this game so far. It's, it's so fucking good. And the fact that it's a PC climb is, is god tier. You don't need a VPN or anything to play this. I haven't tried playing it on mobile, but if you link your account like I did with this game... Uh, you can probably just log in on your phone if you get it working on your phone, downloading on your phone. The link I put in the description for the download for the game has the PC version, the Android version, and the iOS version on there. If you're on iPhone, you might have to have a Korean account to download it. But if you're on a Android, it's very easy to download it because you can literally go through Koo app or um, TapTap or even just maybe just straight up download it from the browser. Yeah, see, so this this is you. This is the main character. Very good. I'm going to have a actual detailed first impressions on the game. I do want to just show you quickly, guys, the combat. Oh, man. Okami-sama. You share my destiny. He looks like a twin brother or something. This is why games that have PC clients are god tier, because you can download auto translators like this. Yep, so, like, literally, you're a summoner. You just summoned two other beings with you. Here we go. Here's the, the battle. Victory condition, annihilate the enemy. Ally turn, turn one. Okay, and then scroll here. Dude, it's just, this the animations are so good. Watch this. 
it plays like fire emblem so when you're close to an enemy you can do but there's some crazy skills in this and you're about to see one of them look at this oh this isn't a crazy skill hold on oh is it ultimate it is yeah look at these animations this is fucking beautiful oh my god oh my god this fucking game is beautiful look at look at all the enemies she hits literally all of them look at this this is the ult bro that's crazy holy shit this game is beautiful dude i will be doing a lot of free-to-play guides in this game because there's a lot of shit that you can do free-to-play in this because uh it's a strategy game there is pvp as well in this so there's gonna be a lot of content coming out for this game i'm so happy that i had this auto translator because now i can make content very easily and a lot of people can play it very easily as well now these these scenes are so beautiful like i said i am going to be doing a first impressions on the game uh, but this like this is how you interact this is how you talk this is how the story gets played out it's then you get your choices where am i everything's voice acted supposedly the global version is going to have global like english voice acting which is crazy good i um, very excited for that this game is going to be incredible um I think it's going to be a pretty big game on uh with a lot of with a lot of people content creators i think you can make a lot of content on this which is very good for the health of the game so let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are excited about this as i am uh, let me know if you're going to be playing this with the auto translator let me know if the auto translator worked for you if it did not let me know in the comment section down below and i can help you guys fix the issues if you're having trouble like i said feel free to join the discord the link is in the description down below we have plenty of people in there that are more than happy to help you out if i'm not available if i'm busy i have plenty of mods in there that also know what they're doing and don't know how to help you guys uh, get through this as well if i'm not available so thank you guys so much for watching if i did help you guys out in this video feel free to smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't already to be notified for more videos on archland and other future gotchas that you guys are interested in or jrpg or anime content because uh, that is the other content i do on this channel thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate all the support and i'll see you guys on the next video